Okay, we are down here at the Pixel G and uh, what we have is the new screen and uh, as we know I'm all about mobility. Uh, this screen is something I'm loving. So what we now have here is a, a fully working prototype screen uh, getting really close to actual manufacturing quality of, of the screen screens coming soon. And the main thing here is that we can actually turn off and on the backlight, which means we save a lot of power. So the screen itself is about the same as, as we are right now seeing on uh, many devices. We are talking about under what train on screen only and uh, closer to 200 uh, milliamperes uh, on the next stages of the development. Right now, together with screen, uh, together with the backlight, typically these kind of screens running 3 watts, even 5 on older systems. And now with the press of the button, we can we can drop it immediately to two and a half watts, which means on a typical netbook set, easily half an hour. So what that means on a typical netbook setup, we can easily just with that backlight on off function get half an hour battery life saving on a smaller batteries. Of course, batteries like on my EPC we get huge savings because uh, comparing. 2 watts on a bigger battery, so I, I could run this device with the same battery about uh, 9 to 11 hours. So, huge savings. So, now let's compare it to the normal LC, uh, LED backlight LCD. We are now both on backlights, and I'm cranking the brightness top. And actually, I've, I have the Hackett also on my screen, so I'm, I can put it on double brightness, which will break it if I use it long time. And still, we are getting much much nicer view on a, on a, on a system. So backlight on off. Actually, I prefer here on the sunlight. I prefer it totally with without the backlight. It's much nicer use. So of course, new technology comes new uh, new things to learn and uh, and uh, have. So here we have solitaires. So you can see the difference. We don't have colors when the backlight is off which in many cases on mobile environment that isn't that big deal. We get full movement, so the graphics capabilities, the refresh rate is perfect for normal mobile use, for productivity and so on. We can also place videos nicely, but it's not um, really as good as, as, a, as a normal screen, but still, let's fast forward a bit. This is actually, the picture is picture quality is bad, not the, not so, not the actual uh, refresh rate. So this would suit perfectly on my needs. Uh, which of course comes to a question, when can I get it? <laughs> so of, of course expect me to hack one of these babies to one of my babies and uh, we will see how that goes later. Right now I'm really really happy to finally see that and, and actually prove to myself that this is something you should look forward so in mobility mind in saving battery life saving battery cost and uh, and uh, uh, making it easier for mobile user to use uh, outside this is this is really nice tech so this was Sega K Mobile from Comtech 2009 thank you bye